<coughs> the other important component for videography when we need uh, long recording because this is not a video camera this has a 30 minutes of limit so but with an external recorder you can record a long recording so for this purpose I use uh, a Ninja 2 system this is not an a, not a 4k recording solution this is only uh, full HD <clears throat> but it is not a problem because when I really need that long recording it's very rare when I really want to make a 4k hours of uh, recording but anyhow so and but maybe later so let me just here is here is this one in a uh, 500 uh, gigabytes of uh, SSD hard drive you can see I just put it here which is can hold hours and hours of uh, video <coughs> footage when outside uh, of course we have the option to mount uh, this uh, shield which help you see the screen nicely as you can see but for now I just simply mount the uh, recorder on the small rig cage <coughs> here is my very nice solution uh, let me just mount it maybe it would be best to mount it here or maybe here mm, let's mount it here and for this purpose I just remove this microphone and I use anyway the other microphone a stereo microphone okay. okay here is the external recording mounted safely and then I have here another microphone which is a stereo microphone uh, with a windshield let me just mount it here let me see if it fits here nicely It's okay and then the reason I want to this uh, we have two options either you can mount this microphone into the camera and then uh, the usual way and then the camera will transform transport the audio via the HDMI cable HDMI sorry HDMI cable over to the sound this is the HDMI cable from my camera over to the recorder and I also need a battery fortunately the battery is exactly the same I have a number of these that I can use on my uh, LED lights I have to mount this battery on this slot 
and then I just turn on the ninja, the microphone, Okay, as you can see, this is a touch screen and we can see immediately the screen and uh, of course uh, this is just a, a recorder and then the camera pumps a very a clean uh, signal over to this uh, <coughs> external recorder and here I simply start recording as you see and then uh, the whole uh, video so the microphone takes an excellent high quality sound pumps the data pumps the sound into the camera and then a camera over to the ninja the ninja also has a microphone input here so I could also <coughs> Uh, in insert or to say plug the uh, microphone jack into this uh, slot but this is more convenient as you can see so this is one of the solution but this one uh, this setup is uh, <coughs> uh, full HD only so this is not uh, uh, not uh, 4k uh, setup because this uh, recorder uh, cannot uh, do recording and then uh, when I start however keep in mind that uh, uh, when I press the button the record button here what you can see is that uh, the camera records internally a uh, 4k uh, signal a 4k video and on the outside here on this uh, this records a full HD recording so you can use both recording internally the only uh, problem is while you are recording uh, internally 4k as you can see the screen is uh, uh, blank that is that is blacked out the, uh, the reason is that uh, this um, camera is uh, not able to handle the screen while an HDMI uh, cable is uh, included so keep in mind that this is a limitation of every Sony uh, 4k cameras at least this type of uh, photographic cameras combined with uh, 4k that when you start internal recording uh, combined with a uh, HDMI external recorder the touch screen uh, actually the touch screen works it uh, focuses, uh, works excellently, but uh, uh, it it's very hard to focus this way because you cannot see the screen. So uh, that was it. stop recording start recording and then stop recording as you see when I stopped recording the uh, camera came back the, uh, the, the, the monitor came back and is showing the live view